Hey everyone, today I'm going to be making a cardinal plush to go with my Fuzzy Sock Bird series. This plush definitely has similar elements to my first bird plush, so I'll link that video in the description below if you want to take a look at that, but I'll be explaining the whole process again in detail in this video. So let's get started with making the cardinal. For the fuzzy socks, you'll need everything from the bottom of the heel to the toe of a red sock, as well as a scrap of black sock fabric. All the other materials we'll be using today will be listed in the description box below. The first thing you'll want to do is turn the red sock inside out. Then, right below the toe, draw a round head shape with a sharp protruding bit to mimic the feathers that stick up on a cardinal's head. I didn't like the outline I drew here, so I redid it off camera on the back of the sock, so use this one as a reference instead. Now we're just going to thread the needle. If this is your first fuzzy sock plush, you can check out my guide to working with fuzzy socks for extra tips and tricks, linked in the description. Now begin back stitching along the line you drew. Once you make it to the end of the line, tie several knots and cut the thread. Then cut off the toe about a quarter inch away from the line. Next, cut the sock in half right at the base of the heel, and then you'll want to flip your piece inside out. Add a small amount of stuffing to the cardinal's head feather things, then a large ball for the body. As you can see, I split it into two additions. Then add a small piece for the tail, just like we did with the regular bird. Now you can close the gap with a running stitch. Basically, what you want to do is make a series of large stitches all around the opening, then pull it closed like a drawstring bag. As you pull, stuff the raw edges into the plush and secure it with a couple of stitches. Tie a couple of slip knots and hide the end. At this stage, your bird should look similar to this. Since obviously the sock was black, I couldn't trace an outline to cut around for the cardinal's face, so I just cut out a rounded triangle shape that was a decent size on my plush. And here I'm just cleaning it up a bit. Then I just whip stitched it onto the face like so. Now your plush should look something like Shy Guy from Mario. Draw out two small wing shapes, slightly larger than the wings on my basic bird pattern. Backstitch around both of them, leaving a quarter of them open for turning. Cut them out, then turn them inside out and close it with a whip stitch. Without cutting the thread, sew them onto the body. Now we're going to needle felt the beak. 
If you don't know how to needle fold, there are a lot of other alternatives you can use to make the bead, and they'll be listed in the description box below. Fold a bit of red felting wool in half and felt the tip. Then fold the wispy end around the felted end and felt it into a beak shape. When you needle felt, the ends are usually left wispy to attach onto other felted pieces, but since we're sewing it on, you'll want to felt all sides really well. Now you can sew it onto the center of the bottom half of the face. Next, I'm going to super glue on some flat backed eyes. You can also sew on beads or tie knots with a black embroidery thread. And with that, we're finished. If you want to check out some of the other bird plushies in this series, I'll link the playlist in the description as well as in the end card. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe for more fuzzy sock plushies, crochet tutorials, and any other DIYs I feel like doing. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!